I work for Openreach and I'm a network planner. Yeah, I work on the fibre network, so I'm planning large high value Ethernet circuits. I work five day week, nine to five, or well I work eight four. Did my A-levels first, left sixth form, then I did a degree in business management. Uh, after that I went into a call centre. I just felt like I wanted to do something different within the apprenticeship team. I heard lots of good things about it. So I thought, I think that's something for me. It sounds like a challenging role and earn and learn, which I think is one of the, the main benefits in apprenticeship. Not come out with all the debt like I have from university. <laughs> My perception of apprenticeships originally was, I thought it was mainly males who went into apprenticeships like being an electrician or a plumber. I didn't realise that there was apprenticeships in lots of different companies, in lots of different roles and you know, that there was more things for females to get involved in as well, especially within BT, you know. But I say some females might like to go into the engineering, the field engineering. I've met a lot of female apprentices since I've been working here and they love it. But for me personally, I wanted to do something, you know, systems based. I found this very challenging, which I'm enjoying. I enjoyed university. It was fun, but so is an apprenticeship. Looking back on it, how much I enjoy this apprenticeship, I probably would have just liked to do this. But I've learnt a lot of life skills from university, you know, teamwork, communication, even presentation skills, all stuff that I have actually been able to bring into this job role. So it has been useful, but I don't think you need to be all and end all. You know, apprenticeships are very good. So when you first start, um, field engineers do a longer residential training course, but for Office Space I did a three week training course and that was like a general open reach induction course. So that did involve me climbing up a telephone pole, uh, going down manholes. It was brilliant actually, I got to meet lots of new people, all apprentices you know, beginning the journey. It was something different, it's something I never thought I'd be getting involved. I was definitely scared climbing the pole but you've got to overcome those things, you know, that's part of open reach. So I get one day every three weeks to work on my academic work, at my MBQ and my BTEC. And usually there is uh, apprentices from other parts of the business and they come in um, and we all work together, you know, um, as a group. Yeah, I'm very proud to work for BT actually. Um, I when I speak to people and I say who I work for, they go, wow, you've really done well for yourself there. And I do agree with that. They do look after you very well. There's lots of support. You know, not just on the academic side with your apprenticeship, I mean, operationally, you know, you're part of a big team and there's lots of different opportunities, volunteering opportunities. There's a lot to learn. It's really interesting. I love working for them. You have to be prepared to work hard and you have to understand that you're in charge of your own academic journey, you know. You're going to have support there, but you've really got to take charge, make sure you meet your deadlines, you know, completing your work to the best of your ability because doing that opens up other opportunities for you. The company wants you to come in as young people and bring new ideas to the table. I think it's suited to people who want to work hard, who want to try something new, who you know, they're not, not afraid to get your hands dirty because <laughs> you do have to do that in your training, you know, it's hands on. You know, the environment's quite relaxed that you work in. Obviously, there's an expectation that you're gonna meet goals and you're gonna work hard, but we have a lot of fun, especially in this office. We have a lot of fun while we do our work, so it is enjoyable. I love coming into work with my team. There's lots of opportunities to, you know, socialise and get to know other people. It is fun. There's a lot of things that you can do. I'm working with technology, Ethernet as well. That is just growing and growing and growing. It's fast moving and there'll always be advancements in it, so it's an exciting sector to be in. In the future, I would like to go into management or potentially move over to the apprenticeship team, you know, as an apprentice coach or an apprentice manager. So, they're my goals, hopefully. <laughs>